I'm, I hope the camera is on. Yeah. Okay. So what's up everyone? I hope you guys are good. I hope everyone is safe. It's been a while. I've been wanting to vlog for a while, but whew, you know how sometimes you don't feel like doing anything and before you put a camera to talk, you have to be present uh, and emotionally stable and um, for some time now, I haven't been okay to be able to sit in front of the camera to talk to you guys, but I think um, I feel better this morning, so I'm like, why not? Let's have a little chat because it's been a while. So now let's talk about the big elephant in the country now, coronavirus. So now the world is facing the um, terrible, horrific living now. Um, it's all because of this virus. So now in my country, Ghana, you cannot cough in peace. You can't sneeze in peace. You can't, um, you can't be sick now. Let's take a lot of things into consideration because there are some people who are naturally sick. They are naturally having cold and flu without it being COVID-19. And because of the fear of this virus and the stigma attached to it, people are really scared to come out and say they are sick. Even if you are having a headache, it's, it's, it's really scary to even say because people might think it's that. Um, regardless, I think even if you are feeling that type of way, you shouldn't be scared to to voice it out or you shouldn't be afraid to go to the hospital. There are certain parts of our country that has been locked down and I think it's for the best. So for these two weeks, I think we have to all be safe. The precautions, the measures, the everything that the government has come out to say we should do, I think when we, when we go by it, we will be fine. Myself, I know. <laughs> this is scary. <laughs> and I don't know. Um, you be there and you feel you have a headache. And then you start associating with the virus in your head. If you are feeling that way, put it at the comment section below. Because um, I remember taking like cold water two days ago so usually when i take cold water i get I, I i tend to get like itchy my my ears will start itching me and then um in my throat too so yesterday i told my colleagues that i'm having itchy in my ears <laughs> and they were all running away <laughs> so now you can't even be sick in peace for crying out loud before coronavirus we were living our lives we were you know everything is happening and it was normal but since coronavirus nothing is no more normal but um guys, there are people who still don't believe the virus is real i still know of people who think that is like it's just political but people are dying people are really suffering so far as i don't know of anybody that doesn't mean that it does not exist the muslim guys oh god they, they just don't believe it but this is virus you can do whatever but if you are not careful you can pray but if you are not careful you are going to get the virus regardless so please those who sit at the base and my muslim women you know for us when we go to the washroom uh, we put our hands down there yeah we wash we do clean up so please before you you, you try to clean wash your hands wash your hands thoroughly before you take your hands de down there please. i keep saying my muslim brothers and sisters because some of us we have a very hard ears or how do i say <laughs> we feel say oh we'll be fine we've prayed nothing will happen i still have people who are saying that oh this thing is not even in ghana but guys it's, it is We've recorded like how many people do, but we have people dying, not even in Ghana, but it's across the world. And then it's on TV, it's on radio. So like it saddens my heart when I hear people say that it's not real, it's not happening. Guys, please, my Muslim men, please stop sitting at the base. If someone is having, we 
even we're still talking about social distancing but it's not happening in our zongo community it is not happening please guys let's try and then protect ourselves let's wash our hands let's use sanitizer whatever preventive measures that you've you've heard of and let's try and boost our immune systems if you know of anything that can help boost immune system please try and take it try and take vitamin c um i heard of um neem tree you can start drinking and you can boil it and put lime in it and be drinking it helps to boost your immune system and then it helps with a lot of diseases and us it is also good so you can also try that Huh. and let's let's be careful let's be safe guys our health is more important than anything i know there are certain people when they don't go to town their family members won't eat but in this crucial moment guys trust me it's better you save your family than exposing yourself to this virus so please guys let's try and also pray as well because it is not by our minds it is not by anything it is by the grace of god and then we are just pleading with god to have mercy on us because there are certain countries who are saying that they've done all that they have could so now we are all looking up to god so in as much as we are looking up to god and praying let's also try and play safe guys i will try and then do funny videos so that you guys can laugh we can't before coronavirus we were living our lives and we can't let this virus take control over our lives we have to laugh and even it's good to laugh so i'm trying i'm trying to bring out some funny videos so that you guys can watch and laugh it can always be it can always be um fear and panic if you know that let me let me let me say this if you know that you have anxiety reading the news or you have an you have anxiety hearing about the virus please try and stay away from the news or the radio if you want for once or twice you can try and go to like um, reliable sources for information you can any news concerning coronavirus and just live your life because um, if you have good health your body would definitely fight it and then um, I don't even know what to say <laughs> guys let's just play safe if you have not subscribed as I always say please kindly do subscribe and then I'll see you in my next video bye